From the Center for the Arts Studios, this is your AU TV News Break. I'm Michaela Weimer. Thanks for tuning in. The Ashland University Coburn Art Gallery is set to host an exhibit from October 5th through the 29th. The painting exhibit will feature work from an AU alumni, Jamie Lindholm, who currently resides in Colorado. Most of her current work is done with using oils and charcoals and has been presented all over the United States and Sweden. Lindholm's work now will be featured at her alma mater where she graduated from in 1983. The Coburn Gallery is open from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. weekdays and noon to 4 p.m. on weekends. Gallery admission is free and open to the public. In local news, Wednesday night, there was a debate held at the Ashland Public Library on cleanup of the Union Pacific Railroad rail yard site northeast of downtown Ashland. The cleanup is expected to start in the summer of 2024 and requires several months to fully take place. This site was used for more than 100 years and has left behind many toxic materials, such as heavy metals, including arsenic, lead, and heavy hydrocarbons. About three feet of contaminated soil will be removed from the site. As for the use of the site moving forward, the city and Union Pacific have engaged in a lengthy back and forth debate for the nearly 20 acre land. In national news, on Wednesday, officials were called to the Southern California home of singer Britney Spears to conduct a wellness check. Spears posted a video on social media of her dancing with knives. Someone close to the singer called the authorities as they were concerned for her safety. Since the video was posted, there have been many debates about if Spears is simply expressing her creative freedom or if she has gone too far. Many fans of Britney are expressing their concerns of mental issues that the popular singer may have. Now a look at our five-day weather forecast here in Ashland, Ohio. Today we see partly cloudy skies with a high of 71 and a low of 54. The rest of the week, we will see sunny skies with a high of 76 and a low of 53 on Saturday. For Sunday, we will be expecting a high of 78 and a low of 54. Monday and Tuesday will both be in the 80s, with Monday being a high of 81 and a low of 58, and Tuesday being a high of 82 and a low of 57. That is it for the AUTV News Break. Be sure to follow us across all social media at AUTV. I'm Michaela Weimer. Thanks for watching.